adding up to 500. We are going to be adding up to 500. Now, these problems can all be solved in many different ways, and you need to choose which one suits you best. All right, I'll show you several problems and we'll use different strategies to solve them. So as you can see, we have 230 plus 90. So this time we're going to split up the numbers. So we'll split up 90 into 70 and 20. And then we'll add them. So 230 plus 70 equals 300. And then 300 plus 20 equals 320. So as you can see, we can make a problem easier by splitting up a number. Now we have 178 plus 148. So this time let's try something new. We are going to add 2 to 178 to make it 180, an easier number to work with. So if we add to this one, let's subtract to the 148 to even out the numbers. All right, so now we have 180 plus 146. Now we can break this down even further. 180 plus 20, and then we'll take the 146 and we'll minus the 20 to even them out. So now we have 200 plus 120. 6 equals, so now it's much easier to work with, so now we know that equals 326 because we just add 1 to the 200 and then the 26. Alright, now we have the problem 210 plus 191. Let's find a different way to solve this problem. So this time we're going to break up the number into 200 and 10. And for the 191, we'll make it 100, a 9, 90, and then the 1. Okay, so let's start adding these numbers up. So let's do 200 plus the 100. Okay, we'll cross them out so we know we don't have to use them again and get confused. So that equals 300. Okay, now for the 10 plus the 90. So 10 plus 90 we know equals 100. And now we just have this 1 left over. So 300 plus 100 plus 1 equals 401. Let's solve another problem. 246 plus 158. So again remember, pick the way to solve the problem which is easiest for you, but I'll show you a new way now. So 246 plus 100 equals 346. And now we have the 5, so which would be 50. So we can do 346 plus 50 equals 396, and now we just need the 8. But we can also split up the 8 into a 4 and a 4 to make it even easier. So then we have 396 plus 4 is 400, and then plus 4 again is 404. Great work solving these problems, and just remember to find the way that's easiest for you and to stick with it. Good luck.